Okay, so once you have a Gmail account set up, you want to go ahead and learn how to use YouTube. So open up your internet browser. Once you get here, you want to sign in. I'm at google.com. That's my home page. Now I have an account here we're going to use called Joe Dummy 26 And the password, you just log in normal. Now, once you're here, you know, it shows your name, it shows all this, and basic homepage logged in. Up here at the top, you see the plus Joe, that's your Google Plus account that you have. You have search, options, image, maps, play, YouTube. That's the one. We want to click it. And this will show us different settings. Um, because I've already logged in once and they ask you, they go through some different tutorial, you know, screen by screen will say, are you interested in these channels, entertainment or sports? So just click through it. Um, once you get that, then you'll be set up here. What this is, it just shows you what to watch, um, different ideas since I had uh, filled in like entertainment and sports so you get these different channels, ESPN, um, so that's kind of cool. You can check that out. This is just giving like suggestions. Well, of course, we're actually we can go directly to ESPN's channel by clicking that, and this takes us here. This obviously is a nice, high-quality uh, channel. They've got 271 million views. It tells how many subscribers to this channel. Um, and it'll start playing a video of the most recent game. Now, that's actually five days ago, College Dunk of the Year. Then you have, just like any other channel, um, you scroll down, you'll see a lot of other lot of videos to choose from. Now, I'm already subscribed to it. I can unsubscribe by clicking that, but I'll go ahead and stay subscribed. Back to YouTube on the left corner. This um, is our pretty much the main dashboard is what you can think. They recently updated this so it's it's a little more sleek but kind of difficult uh, to navigate so that's why we're going through this. Um, these watch later you can actually choose if you want to watch a video later but you do that by let's like for example TV shows we'll click on this one just because it's here. This is the ABC network which I'm subscribed to as you'll notice, it's just like TV. It is TV. It's the new TV. The old, um, it's kind of like the change from snail mail to email. Well, old cable TV to YouTube. Um, that's the best analogy I can do on that. But once you're here, this is a two minute video. This is just playing. Um, let's say we don't have time to watch it, we're going to pause it. Um, we'll say I like it, so let's like it, and that's going to track every option you do. You say okay. We can we have the option there to make the likes private, but what the heck? I'm just going to be public with it. Now, what else you want to do is okay. You can these options here. Share this video. I can share with on Facebook as long as I'm logged in on Facebook. You know it'll ask me right now, and I'm sure it's logged in on yeah, not logged in. You'd log in there, then you can share with all your Facebook friends that you just watched it, that you, or it'll share it, and it'll allow you to put a message in there with um, a little embedded video. So anyway, then you can tweet, you can tweet it out on your Twitter, um, log in there, or Google Plus, and Google Plus is the social networking uh, product that Google has created about a year, maybe a year and a half ago. So that's how that works. Now, if you want to watch it again, like we were talking about, um, it's one of these options. You can share it about, add to, this would be for playlists. So you can make different playlists. Like we can say add to, down here it says enter new playlist name. Say A ABC TV shows. Create playlist. 
click on that. We added, so it tells us pretty fell safe. Now, let's watch it later. Let's say we just don't have time to watch it now. I've found this before, and sometimes they sometimes they're going to move things. But as long as you know what you want to do, you can always figure it out how to do it. And let's see here. Watch later. There it is. It's one of your options at the bottom. Um, so I'll say we're going to watch this one later. Click. So now go back up here to the top left to the YouTube basic dashboard. Come down here to watch later. There you go. It's going to open it up because we can make a whole list. It's kind of like a playlist. Um, but it is different because playlists are <laughs> just a different animal. Um, I'll show you now. Watch history. This shows us we looked at that for a moment and we looked at that. So this will keep an idea of all the history. Uh, videos. So maybe you watch something and you're thinking, well, wow, that was cool. I watched it yesterday. I don't remember the name of it. Just go back that way. Um, playlists. I had already made one playlist called like 1980 songs. So there's nothing in here, but what I can do is um, go over here and say like 1980s music. You search for it. It's going to pop up. Um, like, here we go, um, the walk through memory, so this is 25 songs right here, this guy, uh, Weasel Man, he has a channel, obviously he's all about music, we'll subscribe to him, just cause, you know, he probably put a lot of effort into it, and sounds cool to me, so you got that, now it's, like I was telling you, we can add this to a playlist, so we can add two on these controls here. And that shows statistics. Flag it if you think you're offended or whatever. But you want to share it or no, we want to add two. Remember we have this um, playlist, 1980 songs, which I made earlier. You might be asking, well, how do I make a playlist? Well, it's simple. We can, we'll click on a different one like, no, this would be good, low. I love the 80s to 89. So. What do you say later when the kids are asleep? That's 43 minutes of music, ladies and gentlemen. Um, so we'll, I'm already going to like it just because that's cool. I'm going to say add to. We're going to make a new playlist. Now, down here, enter a new playlist. We're going to call this one like, um, let's say music over. 30 minutes. Music over 30 minutes worth. I'm going to learn how to spell before it's all said and done. Minutes. Music over 30 minutes. Because we've got, you know, 43 minutes of it. Hit enter. You have an option um, right here. It's We saved it as public, so anyone can see this. You can change it whenever you type it in and say private if you want to make a private list. So music over 30 minutes, click that, boom, we added it to music over 30 minutes. Um, back to this, back to the YouTube, we can look at this, we see all of these re, um, recommended videos. Now for the sake of making shorter videos, I'm going to close this now, but I will continue to make more walkthroughs and demonstrations of um, YouTube, the YouTube dashboard and just navigating around it because it can get kind of daunting and things do change but once you have the basics of this then you can um, click, share, make playlists and it's really cool once you have it all set up. Thank you and if you have any questions or you want me to do some other kind of demonstration type it in the comments. Appreciate it.